anniversary. And after 60 years, we just had a big anniversary celebration every year because Dad said that, that might be the best way to handle it from that point on. But two years later, Dad died. And his last words, and he's on his deathbed, where as he looked right into my mother's eyes, he just simply said, I love you. And then we all sang my dad's favorite song with my mom singing harmony, sang a Red River Valley to it. So uh, I never sing this song without thinking about them or mentioning them. Because without my dad being my business manager, and my mom sewing western clothes for me from the time I was a little kid, you know those kind of arrow talking shirts that you see in the old westerns? Well, I wouldn't be here. They, they totally supported me in everything that I did. And were pretty dubious about it because they were Southern Baptists and they were very suspicious of the entertainment business. And rightly so. <laughs> I've been looking at people How they change with the time Lately all I've been seeing are people Throwing love away, losing their mind Maybe it's me who's gone crazy I can't understand why Why all these lovers Keep hurting each other Good love is so hard To come back So what's the glory in living Doesn't anybody ever stay together anymore and if love never ever lasts forever what's forever for I see love hungry people Trying their best to survive Right there in their hands There's a dying romance They're not even trying to keep it alive So what's the glory in living? Doesn't anybody ever stay together? Murphy. That's what forever is for. Yeah, I see some people out there dancing in the grass. You